Apparently the boys took a liking to fighting the local brigands who raided the countryside. The criminals, angered by the theft of their booty, set a trap for the twins. Romulus managed to escape, but Remus was captured. The brigands took Remus to the local landowner, who turned out to be none other than the exiled Numitor. Numitor was immediately reminded of his twin grandsons, and, realizing that they would be the same age as Remus was now, began to suspect that the boys were his blood. Numitor began making inquiries, and soon learned the particulars of their upbringing and became convinced that they were his daughter's children. The herdsman, knowing Remus was in Numitor's custody, and having himself long suspected that his two boys were of royal blood, decided to tell Romulus the whole story of their discovery by the river. From this, a plan was hatched to return Numitor to the throne. With Romulus leading one group of men and Ramus another, they surprised and killed Amulius and brought Numitor back to Abalonga.